previously on Paranormal Syndrome. He's just looking at himself like, yeah, who's the man? Doing little finger gestures. You are. You're a sexy old bald man. And now for more spooks. Hello everybody, Washoot here, and welcome back to Paranormal Syndrome 2. So, uh, they're just gonna start a movie, I guess. Yo, have you already lost heart? Just what do you know? It feels as if everything until now has just been denied. Just what? Just what do I do? Hemoro, go fight against it. What? What? I was already here. I'm here again. Why am I here again? What the hell? Why am I doing this again? This is weird. Okay. Is this different somehow? The bond of fate is quite a mysterious thing. It brings people together like magnets. The fact that you came to the Special Ops Division is due to some kind of fate. The fact that you met me is as well. Don't resent the paranormal. Don't ever think about avenging me or anything. As long as the paranormal exists, as long as you are here, you have your duty. My business here is done. Now, it's goodbye. That's what it, I at least wanted to tell you at the very last. He died? That's so sad. Why st he started a fire? What? What? Why? What I myself ought to do. Defeat Hashaku Sama. Okay, good. We are on the right save. I was worried there for a second because it was like very similar. Okay, we're gonna defeat that eight, eight foot tall lady. Where is she? I can't save, so we only probably get one chance to do it. Where are you? I'm gonna shoot you with a gun. Can't go that way. Probably have to go down. All right, where are you at? I'm ready. Perhaps around here would be fine. Blow that dog whistle. Hell yeah. Oh, I get it, it's a dog whistle because we can't hear it. Holy shit. This is like intense. Oh my God, we're really fast now. Okay, where are you? I'm oh God, woo! Oh my God, they just teleport? How is that fair? Uh oh, okay, 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 okay. Do they, is there any ma- Oh, uh, any method to the madness. So their attacks are these bouncing balls. That's fair. I, did I do it? I did it on the first, what? I did it on the first try? What? Oh my god, I was like settled in to do that for a long time. You were easier than that little girl in the tub at the very beginning. Kogure? Foo foo foo. I thought you were dead. But we, we knew that he was alive because we played as him, but Himuro thought he was dead. Now, what do I do from here on? Hey, over there. Eh? Hey, what is this? Why is that guy? 
Oh, uh-oh. No way! Hemorosan! Gogorite, just what the heck is this situation? Hey now, face this way. No, no, this is a misunderstanding. After fighting with the paranormal Himuro-san was all worn out into... Uh, it was like this when I came. If so, where were you about to go all by yourself? Some business that's so important that you'd abandon your fallen co-worker. Huh? What is it, Kaga-san? Your eyes look so serious, you know? Where did that always light-hearted personality of yours go? This ain't monkey business anymore, Kogurite. Don't stir honestly. This won't be resolved with just jokes, Kogure. Ha, ah, even you, Kirisha- Wait, what? Kirishima-san? Every one of you are acting violently in front of young women. You won't be popular that way, you know. What the fuck are you talking about? Well, whatever. I have no excuses. And why, you ask? It's because I have this too, you see. That's Timuros. Now, here's a question. If Himuro-san, having been exposed to all the par- Oh, all the ill effects of the paranormal, were to be shot with this right now, do you know what'd happen? Why'd you do that? I thought you were a good guy. Once Himuro-san wakes up, then please tell him that your role will be fulfilled by me. Foo foo foo, now excuse me. Understood. But if you ever do something terrible to Hamurozan ever again, I won't forgive you. This time, I will protect Hamurozan. Yeah. Case number three. Well then, Kogure, why are you being such a dick? Thought you were a good guy this whole time. You just pulled it over my eyeballs. Maybe he's been possessed. I hope that's the case. Kikugawa Police Station, Special Ops Division. Good morning, everyone. It's good weather today, isn't it? Now, right away, we have an announcement. To our great disappointment, Investigator Kogure has quit his job starting today. It seems he's had problems with personal relations at the workplace, hasn't he? Everyone, have you all had proper communications with him? We need to all value personal relations. He's being real sarcastic, poo poo poo. Ha, sound trying to hold in snickering. Now, due to his recent out-of-control behavior, it is now fully evident what this second paranormal syndrome is. Fully evident, huh? So in the end, Kogori Kun really is guilty, you're saying? Yes, as for the details of this incident, we'd like for Hamuro-san to also be here before we explain. He took my gun. Oh, just continue as is. Damn it, I like that gun. Give him a new one. Are you all fine already? Yes, it wasn't anything big. Now, to the main topic. What began everything was the Katori Bako incident at Kajiro House. It proliferated a great amount of paranormal phenomenon that ran amok. You may already know this, but the one who set up the Katori Bako at the Kajiro House was Kogurikun. There was an awful traitor in the Special Ops Division, wasn't there? The paranormal activity that spread from the are there into this town. The wave created by the rock thrown into the water didn't simply die down, but stayed there in town. I then went on my own individual route in collecting info, and thus, it has been found that something had a hand in preventing the second, second paranormal syndrome from calming down. What? Something? I believe none of you know this. As for why, it's because it is the world's backside. The darkness that never surfaces to the front. 
What I say here must never be told to others. This is my background info, so you will die if you don't handle it properly. What? Okay, he's very protective of his personal details. That's fine. Whenever a disaster happens in Japan here, there was always something at that location point moving around. It is not a spirit, but more like a sorcery tool. The Ryomen Sukuna. Perhaps you will all know of the curse called Kodoku. By putting many insects into one vessel and letting them kill each other, the curse is made using the final survivor. Well, that's a famous tale, isn't it? The Gryomen Sukuna is a cruel and human curse, made not from bugs, but humans killing each other. And what it is, is the mummy of the last survivor. So that thing moved into Kakugawa City. Yes, there's no mistaking it. Are you able to pinpoint its location? It's in the Kikugua color, a front company that poses as a photography company on the surface. We don't know what they do behind the scenes. Maybe they do photography, just for real. So that means that'll be our next destination, huh? Okay then, I'll go. I thought you'd say that, Himuro-san. Do you have a spare aura gun? What? There is... What? I thought you shot bullets. Yes, this will be the last one. Good. Now then, today we will be executing our mission at... Oh, what What do you call that? Zero, 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 midnight. But there's a military server for that. Oh, oh, zero, zero. Whatever, straight up midnight. There's a name for it. I can't remember. All the members here will serve as backup. So brace yourself until then. What, are you going to help this time? Ah, oh, that'll be different, considering how you just like radio me and tell me stuff. Case number four. Paranormal Syndrome. Hell yeah, I'm ready. Bring me it. Bring it on. I'll take care of it. Oh, is Makoto gonna help us? Yo, Makoto-chan. Hey. Don't call me that. Bo, oh, by your face, it seems like your guest, haven't you? That's right, it's me. Do you remember hearing this voice? Why do you know Himuro-san? Well, you don't have to be that alert. I'm Himuro's co-worker. I have an important notice for you today, you see. Will you hear me out for just a little? That what is it? Hemero-chan, you see, has been doing an unreasonable amount of work. You called him Hemero-chan? Just think about it. About these several months since the paranormal syndrome that happened with you. You just have to wonder how many paranormal phenomena he's had to deal with seriously. Aren't you a little worried? I, I think that he simply is that kind of person. Think about it a little. See now, young girl. That guy doesn't have the kind of immunity you do. He's a bit tough, but that's it. No matter how many small protective spirits accompany him, he's about to reach his limit. Wh what do you mean? If that guy continues receiving the ill effects of the paranormal just as is, what do you think would happen? He'll receive the ailment of calling forth the paranormal in other words, he'll catch the same paranormal syndrome you also had, and die. Is that... what? Do you understand why I came to you? No, can you elaborate, please? Uh-oh. Oh, uh, please advance directly forward. Okay, I will advance directly forward. I'm not going to take any steps to the left or the right. Just going to go forward. What? Oh, I forgot. Shift is not run. Himuro-san, you're going too far. Okay, going back. Oh, wait, this way? Ahead is Kikugua Color. 
please secure the Roman Sukuna and apprehend its owner. Okay. Oh, that is still not run. Gun time. Hell yeah. Where are you, you little freak? Oh. I thought we were inside or like in a dream or something. Oh. Hello. What is this area? The locker room can be seen from here. But we're not going to do a single goddamn thing about it. Get in there. It is locked. Damn it. Oh my god. I thought a policeman would be able to do that cool foot thing where there's open doors. But instead, we're going to have to open it like little tiny whatever with the keys. Make sure we do it perfectly, completely the right way. It's locked. I have no idea what it is. Comparatively, all these books are quite old. Okay, comparative to what? I have no time to read. You have to make time to read. It's good for you. What did that say? Oh, photography. Okay, that's better. Doesn't seem to have been used for several years already. Okay, get it out of... Okay, thank you. Some kind of machine, it seems. Operate it. There you go. It was a computer. There's a card slot. I don't have a card. A photography company, huh? As of now, the demand for that is getting smaller and smaller. You guys, everybody can just call themselves a photographer because I have a goddamn phone. Oh my god. Remember, when I was going to college, I had, oh, a great amount of gum inside. Oh, this is the resident gum chewer, huh? Anyway, I had this guy. He was a professional photographer. He was like 30 or something like that. But he had, was going back for um, design. Because remember, I, I do design as well. I got a degree working now. But at the time, he had photography. It pissed him off so much when people say, I'm a photographer. And he would look at their pictures like you have like literally. You're either a photographer with zero talent or zero training. Just because you have a camera doesn't make you a photographer. In the same way that going out and buying a Wacom tablet doesn't immediately make you an artist. You have to put in the work. Work desk. Got to do the push-ups to be able to gain the strength, be able to do the work. And then you can call yourself that thing. Where the hell am I going? There was nothing in there. If we find a card, I know where to go with it. You know what the best part about this game is as opposed to the last one? Because last time I remember we were in the workstation and there was the police and whatever. We have a gun this time. Because before we had to go and just pick up random things and throw them at the monsters and the spooks as they came in. There's no one here. Kigugu, a color, is something that exists only in name. It probably has almost no actual staff. Okay. Just who is the owner of the Roman Sukuna? His name is Monovi Tengoku. The leader of the cult called the Tenmi School. To say it briefly, he's just a rotten scoundrel, isn't he? He is part of the wicked cult carrying on a former leader's wishes and is trying to curse all of Japan even now. Why? Understood. I will search him out and put him in shackles. Okay. Put him in shackles, huh? Just kill him. Found locker room key. Hell freaking yeah. That's exactly what I needed. Let's not forget to turn off the fire. According to the articles here, as far as I can see, this has become an abandoned building ever since the year 2000. That took quite a while to be abandoned. Quite a long time. Slightly dirty bottles. Just how old is this? I don't want to touch it. You gross. Nothing. Nothing. Water. Something. Cool. Thank you. Gas stove. Awesome. Okay. Let's go check the locker room real quick. Since we have a key for it. I really wish I would be able to access my inventory to be able to like see. I remember I mentioned that in one of the previous episodes. It was just like being it. Oh, wait, it's right here. Being to actually look at your inventory triggers ideas about what to do. Instead of just assuming. This must be it. There you go. Use the locker room key. Thank you. Get in there. A bunny. Hello. Just making sure. A rabbit doll. Its stomach part is bulging out. Rip it open. Rip it apart with your bare hands. It's locked. Only this locker feels like it's being used. Is someone using this, I wonder? Probably. Yeah, he just said that none of these felt that way, but I'm going to check anyway. Be careful. To forget and leave things behind. What? The papers and tatters. Awesome, thanks. I'm wasting my time. Okay. I. Why would you... Okay, so the rabbit has a bulging gut. Are we supposed to stab it with something? Knife, maybe? Get its inner doubt and throw them all around on the floor. Summon our own paranormal activity. No Japanese books here. Perhaps they're related to China or Korea. Maybe. It's all fishy, shady stuff here. 
It's like Undyne. A clock. It seems to still be moving. Clocks have a tendency to do that. Even right now, the clocks that you are not paying attention to in your home slash house slash apartment, they've been working regardless of your attention to them. Nothing inside. That the whole point of the clock is to do that for you. Have one purpose. It's locked. And over here. Oh, we're going to go in the girls' room because we're a pervert. I didn't actually think they were going to let me. Nothing of concern here. Maybe we can find a razor. Women used to shave. Be able to use it to cut open the rabbit. Or shave the rabbit's legs. It feels like it's been used as I thought. There's really is someone who's settled here. Duh. Maybe. That is amusing. Okay. Let's try this one. Oh, they just got two toilets. Towel is clean. Okay, so the person here is probably female. Or a male that identifies as a woman. Guns drawn! Where are you? This is way too peaceful. I was expecting monsters. Whoa, what the hell? It's locked. Dang it. Let me into one of these rooms. Tower of all this foreplay. People on a paddy field. Waffle. 1946. The name of the artist is Waffle? That's weird. They each their own. Oh my god, where is the knife? I'm going to use the disembalanced rabbit. I'm looking forward to it. Stop with this. What is this? A giant table? Whoa. Reminds me of the thing off Princess Miller and okay. The forest spirit. Weird ass giant head. Oh my god, I this is taking way too much patience. Oh. Uh oh. What is this? This sudden feeling of as if I'm about to hurl. Ew. Like going on a roller coaster? A decorative plant. Okay. Found executive room's key. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck is that thing? Uh-uh. Get me out of here! Oh, no. Am I safe or am I fucked? I'm fucked! Woo! Get out of here! Woo, okay. Oh my god, it's a little freak. Kill it, 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 kill it. Oh my god, it's disabled. Kill it. What the fuck are you doing? Oh god! Okay, I get it. Okay. We have to play this little freaky game. Okay, I understand. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, God! Woo! That way? What the fuck was that shit? Pick it up and destroy it. Is that just naturally what this character does? Like, Makoto had the tendency of, like, judging things. This guy's just like, mm, let me just open this cabinet. He just smells inside there's like, oh, it smells like mold. Oh, yeah. What did we get? Stupid old doll made me forget everything that I was doing. I'm pretty sure that we had a key. I'm pretty sure that's not the executive room. If I was to flip an executive, I wouldn't want the most pompous place and possibly imaginable. This right here. I don't know how to think like an executive, clearly. Where would you put that? I would want it to be like above and away from a maniac little plebeian employee so I could be like, oh yes, yes, come up to my office. I want to have a discussion with you. There we go. Use the executive room's key. You want to run across from, oh my God, he wanted his executive room across the room from a normal ass. Okay, we're fine. We're cool. I can't shoot it. Oh my god. I hate everything. Woo! Oh god. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're cool. All I was gonna do was check and make sure this room was normal. We're gonna, we're gonna get corded! Oh my god, I don't want to get mauled by a chair. Woo! Paranormal Syndrome, the game that makes you fear chairs. Wow, you had to do that one three times. And it just gets stuck spinning. Oh my god, that is a chair I am never going to sit in voluntarily. All I was going to say is he wanted to be across the room from the goddamn communal eating room. I completely forgot everything I was doing. 
there's a hastily writing writing on it. Read it? Okay. A few months passed since coming to Kikugawa City. I came here as I'd noticed the characteristic pool of the paranormal. But now I can't feel even a bit of the malic. Wait. Oh, malice I felt then. What the heck is this? Someone's began to notice my activities. It seems a traitor is among my clients. Maybe they cowered, realizing the curse was real. That monkey! It'd be bad to be traced. Let's leave Kikugawa City. Today is quite a wonderful day. I sensed a malice quite close to the one I felt that time. In my inquiries, I found it was related to Hakai. Although, it's like a baby compared to my Sukuna. I'm blessed with a golden opportunity. This stage, Kikugawa City infested with the paranormal. Here, I shall accomplish the Tenmi School mission, together with my Roman Sukuna, Manobi Tengoku. What? I see now. So this guy is a rotten scoundrel, huh? We were already told that. Awesome, flipping. Kill the chair. Is he hiding something in here? Expensive looking clothing! It's not Japan made stuff. Oh no, it's a dirty westerner. Documents. H. M. Nectar. What? Pokemon move. H. M. Permanent move. Nectar. There's something in the drawers. Where is it? Found a green car key. Hell yeah. Thank you. Is this Chinese sorcery? That's racist. Amount of books. This is human anatomy, huh? I can only get a bad feeling about this and an erection. Huge map book. Okay, let's go ahead and put in the green card into the computer that we turned on. Maybe it will go boop, boop, killed all the paranormal for you. Oh, that. I saw that. Why is the light blinking? What? I can't say. Oh, I can't say. Bad sign. Oh, no. Oh, my God. What is it? Oh, my God. It's a little squid. Kill that thing. Oh god, we're fucked, we're fucked, we're fucked! Oh my god, this is getting too, too intense. Kill that little thing. I'm ready for you. Back away from it this time! You can't trick me three times in a row. Backing away. Why is it a little robo-squid? They are getting so creative with their freaking... Oh, I get it. Squid's electricity, getting rid of the power. Oh, wait, squids don't do that, that's eels. That didn't make any sense at all! Wasn't even the right place. And it's gone. Perfect. Awesome. Didn't want to look at it anymore anyway. Where are we? Put that green key card in there. Put it in there. Boop. Eradicating all paranormal from everywhere in the world. I put it in there. Is it doing something? Is this it? What did I do? I put in a green key card and nothing happened. Little tease. Can I... Oh my god. Do something. Put. Fine, I'll just leave. Fuck this game. Come back in. I had to process for a little while. Is there something that it did or not? I'm not getting any feedback. Stupid. Oh my god. Green key card it won't turn on. Did we get permission to do something? It unlocked the door somewhere. Normally, when something like that happens, it will go boop, a door open somewhere. Thank you. So you know and you're not confused about what the hell is going on. Am I supposed to do something? Fine, I'm just gonna leave. I'm gonna walk around some more, kill some more things, and come back. Clearly, that's what we're supposed to do. I knew it! I freaking knew. Oh, what the hell is that thing? I don't understand, like, what the hell is going on. I thought that it was the freaking. Oh my god. That was extremely confusing. I thought it was the deer that was gonna murder me. Found a blue key card key. Thank you. Awesome. Okay, so I get what's going on. We're just gonna walk around in random circles until we get a bunch of card keys. No, I, I was a game designer. I'm just saying is clearly I can't do it better than this person. They are amazing in every way, shape, and form. I would have said, this machine requires a couple more card keys. I literally spent, I don't even know how long pressing buttons in here. Put it in there. I do it? There's a- Oh my god. Okay, so there's probably one more. I'm gonna guess red, green, and blue. What do you think? I was the last card. 
I would be the bunny in here. Okay, never mind. Oh, okay. Oh, gotcha. Thank you. Oh, we opened it. There's nothing in it. Oh. There's something shiny. Found bar key. What? There's a bar in here? Where the hell's the bar? I want a bar in my freaking home or place of work. Actually, people would probably be a lot less productive if they could drink on the job. Pretty sure that only... American government parliament is one of the only places you're allowed to actually drink while you're at work and they're not very productive, are they? Let's not be like the American government. This? Oh! Used bar key! It's not actually a bar, is it? Oh my god, it's actually a bar. Why? That is very strange to me. There's signs that someone drank here. Yeah, what about the shiny? Oh, found knife! Thank you. A bar, huh? That's an odd thing to build here. Good, I'm not the only one. Oh god! Uh-uh! No, oh. No, 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 no! No, 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 no! No, 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 no. Not okay. Get the fuck out of here, you little animal. Unload fire. Get. Oh, that is so cheap. Oh god. We're fine! Woo! Oh god. It's gonna have to be this one! Oh my god. That was flipping close. He wanted to serve us a drink. Get the hell away from him. I don't even know what I just got. I went into that bar. I was making a comment about how weird it is. American government. What the hell did we just get in that stupid room? Was it... We were by the drinks. It was a knife. Okay, we're fine. So we're going to disembowel the rabbit. Probably acquire either a key or a key card. And we'll go from there. The rabbit's going to be gone. Just watch. Oh, oh you poor little... You poor little rabbit. You don't even know it's coming. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, cut it open with the knife. Oh, enjoy it too. Thank you. Found red card key. Thank you. Sorry, rabbit. I asked you to spit it up. I said please. Don't do what I want when I'm being kind. I'm gonna get the violence. That's how it works. This is not the right room. I walk right by it. Okay. What do you think is gonna happen with this computer? I don't know. There you go. Three cards. You're welcome. Oh. Hello. Oh. That is all this computer does. Is it not? Did something open somewhere? Thank you. That's all that computer does? It takes three key cards to knock a painting off of the wall? What? That is definitely strange. That's like Legend of Zelda-esque mechanics there. I love it, even though I just complain about it. And the painting's gone. Huh? Oh. What the fuck? No. An elevator? What? Go down. 